everybody, today's video will be about, today's video will be about Koniko from, <sighs> Koniko from High School DxD, from High School DxD, let's see, let's see, it's not meant that we have every, every fact about Koniko, they're probably, they're probably better videos, but anyway, let's get started. Koniko is a part of Ray's, Grimmery's, Devil Family. And originally, Koniko, she's the short one. She's the short one with the white hair. She's the short one with the white hair. Right here. Little and small line. Some might call Koniko a shorty. But anyway, Koniko, when she first meets Issei Hudo, she can clearly see that he's a big per. He can clearly see that he's a big pervert. And she thinks that he's the worst. He's the, he is the enemy of all women. He's the worst. He's the worst of the worst. Because Issei, she thinks Issei has no reducing, has no redeeming qualities. But Koniko, as the series continues, begins to see that she begins to see that Issei is actually a very nice guy. He actually, he actually, he actually is. She, she, as the series goes on, she begins to see that Issei is actually a pretty nice guy. And Issei, and Issei, let's see, as Issei. Goes on as the series goes on. We meet Koniko's sister Kuroka, which we learn that Kuroka likes to call Koniko Shirane. Shirane, that's what she likes to refer to her as. Kuroko's obviously Kono's Koniko's older sister. Older sister. And. She wanted Koniko to go back with her, but Koniko didn't want to go back to her older sister. And then, and then Issei got Issei, Issei got involved and started helping and started helping Koniko out. And as the series go on, as the series go on, once Koniko begins to see that Issei's brave, she thinks that Issei. She says she still says that Issei is a pervert, but it's also a very nice, also a very nice pervert. And since most of this video is based off the anime, by season four, by season four of Koniko, by season four of Koniko wants to treat Issei and she also wants to perform something called bedroom art. So yeah, by by season four, her opinion on Issei Hudo has completely changed from thinking he's a, a really pervert who doesn't really like him to like, who basically like wants to perform bedroom arts on him. She basically fell in love, she basically fell in love with him as the series passed on. She was a, she was the last. He was one of the original girls he met to do so. It was an East States pervert nature. Let's see here. Chronicles abilities. Chronicles abilities. Chronicle. When we first see her, she's dictated to be a woman. She's dictated to be. I would say she have super strength. Well, she's a lot stronger than the average devil. She's not strong. She's a lot physically stronger than the average devil. By me. She's capable. Of, she's capable of lifting very. She's capable of lifting very heavy stuff. Not like some like a car over her hair. She, we haven't seen the upper limits of Konoko's physical strength. And like Kuroka, she also has some type of. She also has some type of magic ability, but she appears to be afraid to use it. She appears to be afraid to use her magic ability because. I guess she's just afraid that she might not be able to control the power. So. Uh, uh, I had to control her magic like her sister Koroga, but I did see this fear. Yeah, but anyway, do you like Kong Code? Do you like those are all the those are all the facts I know. That's all the facts I know about Kong Go. Yeah, that's all. This is clearly this video is crazy with the anime to stress that out. This video is crazy with the anime. Do you like Kong as a character from High School DxD? What do you think of her? Do you think Koniko's a, a decent character? She's well written. Well, let me know in the comments and I will hopefully see you guys in the next video. Next time I make a video about High School DxD. Yeah, I know. It's been a long time since I made a video about High School DxD. But anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed watching this little video about Koniko. I just wanted to break her down because I thought it is be interesting to do a character breakdown video. Anyway, I'll see you guys in the next video. And until then, later.